Just about 640 chances are many of us will get or give chocolate mm -hmm. tomorrow for Valentine's Day. But instead of the traditional, why not try something a little bit more unique? Yeah, this uh, right here is ruby chocolate. Mm -hmm. The chocolate lab in Denver uses ruby chocolate to make truffles, bark, and other items. I like to tell our customers you're going to have a little roller coaster ride in your mouth uh, with this one. Uh, starts off a little sweet, similar to a white chocolate. Then you're going to get um, a little sour note to it. And then we're going to move into kind of a fruity uh, floral note. And then it finishes with that uh, nice smooth chocolate flavor at the end. All right, so the, the Chocolate Lab sent us these chocolates to try. Uh, mine is raspberry Urfa. Oh, yeah, they have different flavors, too. Cherry. Ooh. Come on, I have the, Urfa. Uh, the, Urfa. Urfa. the raspberry chili. Ooh, and there is a little bit of a, a chili. To it. Yeah, there is, and it tastes good. All right. This one's the rose mm. vanilla. It has a little, a little rose petal on the top. Mm. How cute mm. is that? It's you know, good. really good. Now's about the time but it's I should like that, tell you. It's that uh, that cake, that red cake. What's that? Red velvet. Red velvet. There you go. Red yeah, velvet. That's what it tastes like. Love it. It's really yeah. good. You should try them. This was actually <laughs> the first new kind of chocolate in 80 years. Really? Yeah, white chocolate was hmm. eight, like 80 years ago, and then they they came with rose chocolate, dark chocolate, ruby chocolate. Yeah, I licked all the chocolates.